my virtual friends, my name is Catherine, also known as Miss Blue, and welcome to Amethyst Horologist, Radical Archaeologist. This is a game about unearthing the past, which Amethyst does in a radical way. Right then, so let's get into it. I am unbelievably happy that I absolutely freaking nailed that intro, so props to me for being a bit self-centered. But anyway, let's go. Uh, how do we do on this? I have no idea how to play. Ah, oh, there we go. I pressed, I pressed S or W, one of the two. Ah, there I am in the corner over there. Okay, okay then, we are in at last. Oh, it's you. Why didn't you say you were an archeologist? I did not realize I could talk to you, Mr. Ske no, skeleton, I mean scarecrow. Well, so, sorry, a radical archeologist anyway. That's exactly what I am, said on my little ID card as we saw. Well then, I'll be seeing you. Well, I may as well leave this park. Well, I cannot leave this park. I'm well, not even a park. It was more like a construction site. Let's go in here. Ah, yes. The B Mart. Where the hell am I in the context of the world? Ah, uh, I can't see myself at all. I'm moving in all directions. Ah, there I am. Wee! Time travel never gets old. Of course. <laughs> ah, we're in the past now. Oh, okay. Or the future, since this has all been built up now. Hello, Mr. Scarecrow, if that's even what you are. Sorry, miss. You'll have to leave this. Oh, the, this work site. I imagine you had an accent there, but I don't know what it was. But wait a minute. Sir, well, hold on. Ah, is that all you have to say? Well then, fine I shall. With a good day to you. All right, let's go to this building over here. Phew, that was one tall ass tower. <laughs> I'm glad you agree. Anything else to say about that? But I'm too radical for corporate life. I see, okay then, well then. Too radical for corporate life means not too radical for exploring this park down here? That is apparently the case. Perhaps. Alright, I'll go down this way. I just went in a circle. Alright then, I'll probably back into B-Mart then. There's got to be some good stuff going on in there. Hey, this is no time to get snacks. Are you sure, man? My goodness, you are totally not like anything I've ever known before. Not a time for snacks indeed. Anyway. About all this over here. I assume that the only controls I've got so far are just Wasad at this point because it seems to be working fine enough thus far. Can I not? I can't go back in or else I'm just being blocked up. Oh, I'm just blocking myself off. Hey, is that a skull down there? Uh, maybe. I don't know. Uh, shall I? T oh, I got it. Maybe. I got went down there. Ah, here I am again. Oh, that's very colorful. Like that. Oh, and it's layering. Hmm. I'm sure the person who uh, is time traveling, or us for that, is having a grand old time. Hello, Spectre of Death, by the looks of it. Sorry, young lady, but you not, may not enter the church. Why? The church of St. Amethyst is not for the likes of you. Well then, I don't even want to go into your church then if you're going to have a go at me like that, sir. Anything else you got to say on the matter? It was built on the ancient ruin of Tower of St. Amethyst. Aha! Uh -huh. Do you mean the big-ass tower we were just talking about a second ago? Hmm. Alrighty then, that's that hello thing. Cow, dog, pig, that could be literally anything. Hello, spirit of the, of the other realm. Hello again! Hi. I'm a druid. Didn't I just tell you that? You know, let me check my uh, uh, notebook and I just uh, consult it. No, you did not, sir. You did not tell me that kind of thing. Anything else to say? I guard the ancient stones and ruins. I've done for a while. Ah, anything else to say on that front? Don't touch the stones, by the way. Well, I wasn't planning to, but now you maybe want to. Okay, the stones are not to be touched. Got it. Let's go into the Yon Inn. Ah, ye old forest inn. Looks like a fine old pub. Unfortunately, archaeology does not pause for alcohol. Well, it does. But radical archaeologist doesn't. I see. Well then, no pubs for me then. Greetings, my lady. How are you interested in any baked goods? Or are you in actual fact? We have cakes, pies, tarts, buns, strumpets, scones, or scones, depending on what uh, pronunciation you subscribe to. Some pronounce it, well, no, it's scones or scones. Scones or scones, not scoons. Well, sometimes people up here call it scones after Scoon Palace. Somewhere over that way. What did I say? Oh, I must have meant strudels or crumpets. Uh huh. Definitely not running a front organization here. Aha, uh -huh. well, could you be selling there, good sir? Um, take a bun for free. Not trying to buy your, buy your silence. <laughs> sure. Giving things away is just good business. I'm sure it is. Alright, we've exhausted him, I think. 
All right, then. Uh, do I have an inventory I can access at all? I. Apparently not. Okay, then we'll just leave that as is then. Hello, sir. Do you want a bun? Don't touch the stones. All right, I won't. Hmm. Perhaps then. I just got stuck on a plant. Hold on. I can waltz up the road. Nay, I can just come back the same way again. Well, then I'll just go quicker this way. That's how the space time continuum works, apparently, around here. No, you may not see the ruins. Why? The church is bar to infidels, heretics, heathens, vegetarians, non-believers, and agnostics, pagans, radicals, apostles, apparians, non-conformists, cynics, reprobates, scoffers, pan... Pan... Panions? Panyims. Courtesans, nullified nullifidanes, lady folk with suspiciously saprific hairstyles. Anyone else you want to bar, sir? What? Oh, I just don't like bees. What? Conversation has come out of my grasp, lads. I have no idea what the hell's going on. Go in peace. Never. Okay, fine. Right. Good. Well then, I've exhausted all those options. Is there a well here? Or is this what this is? No, I just covered that up. Hang on. You thing. What are you? Hey. Don't suppose you need your mobile phone screen repairing? What to try and resist again? No, no one does. Well, mine's not exactly in the greatest condition, but I can certainly live with the scratches it has. An archaeologist, or a uh, acronistic. No, it's perfectly legal. I have no idea what the word is, but you do you, sir, as long as you're not hurting anybody. I suppose I'm a bit ahead of the market. Considering what's going on around you, yeah, you really are, sir. Okay, right, we've gone in a mighty big circle now. This is, only, this is the first section where we actually get proper stock at this point, but I can get... St hey, a loose cobble might make a nice memento. Can I throw it at someone? <laughs> well, was that the first thing that came to my mind? Hello, dog, cow, sheep thing. Hello, sir. Was it this stone? I touched the stone. Whoopsie. Oh dear, I'm in the ne I'm in a some sort of horrifying otherworldly sphere. While some entity, colourful or otherwise, sings it to me. So yon average day of n nonsense. Hello, sir, you same guy. Greetings, traveller. I'm a humble druid. No, the other guy wait, was the other guy a druid? I was making a joke about consulting my notes, so I don't remember. Uh yes, cool. A sentinel. Oh. Given certain Marvel movies, you are very powerful indeed. I guard these runes, at least until I find a better job. Ah, life as it always is. This was once the Tower of Amethyst, as tall as the sky. Oh. How far, are we going backwards? Are we sure of that? Because I know we went from like modern to medieval or modern something else than medieval. And it's sort of regressing backwards because that was the big ass tower of, of name we do not know, corporate thing. Then we had the Church of Amethyst, or Satan Amethyst, so then uh, apparently is this the same place? So over there is where the church would be on the top left. That might be what's going on here. This is a bygone age, of course. Just ruins now. Hmm. Anyway, nice day for it. <laughs> I suppose that's how you know the conversation has gone very much as far as it goes. Just my nice day for it, and then you just say that over and over again and we'll hope they leave. These might actually be sheep, I have no idea. Okay, I guess I have a pet rabbit now. Cool. Yay! <laughs> okay, I'm glad of that. So now we have a bun that's probably like X amount 100 years old and now a rabbit as well. As you do, this is our radical archaeology exploration. So that is thus what must happen. Grand. I still can't go anywhere. I'm literally stuck on this path forevermore. Oh wait, no, I do have a pebble as well. I do have that. Wait, no, a cobblestone technically. I have that as well, so I need to move this out of the way. Hmm. There'll be a way to do that. It must be something that I can't stand on. That normally gives an indication of what is what in this game. Sometimes, at the very least. Oh, so, oh wait, can I steal your fire? They say what that is. No, you're still saying a lovely day for it. All right, then. We go in the woods and explore fun things in there. Into the woods, maybe sing a musical or two about a conglomeration of Disney films. Hmm. Perhaps not then. Don't want to get sued after all. Hmm. Could our runny, uh, our runny, our bunny, in actual fact, maybe? Uh, oh, I can just walk in here. Hey, it's a bit of ancient mirrored glass. Because obviously that's just lying around. Ah, and we're here again. We're well, here again, being anywhere. Oh, goody. 
Wee! Oh, this is unexpected. Oh, even the time traveling part of this universe is unexpected or perturbed by all this. Museum of General Oddities and Miscellaneous. Ah, rolls off the tongue, doesn't it? Well then, hello, sir. You seem comfortable. Hi, Dr. Horologist. That's me? I think. Did I mention I'm a druid yet? You did. Twice. I actually know that now. Still guarding stuff. Even after all this time. Still indeed, right? Okay, there's the big ass tower over there, which I actually see has an A and an L on it. Interesting. Alright, all right, I think we go in it. Hey, Amethyst Tower. No time to check it out though. Well, okay, then that's your uh, thing to do. Then we shall not do that thing. Well, I suppose that's all that we can do now. So this is one actual check. Gotta be sure. Thought not. And yeah, thought not. There's no escaping this realm. We must always run in a circle as it turns out. Can I actually go inside and actually check the door? I, just, I thought for a second that considering the game's past that you wouldn't actually be able to go in any of the doors. So sensible me, obviously. Right, what are these? An extremely old bun, current. Oh, is these all the things I picked up? Oh, that bunny's in there then, oh God. A shard of mirrored glass from a bygone age. Hmm, this is all the stuff I've collected on my radical exploration through time and space? I think so. A medieval skull, probably a clergyman, who I did not murder, I found an actual fact. Exhibit a Wayne collection, bone. Oh, I didn't get everything. Oh, okay, right, right, right. A cobblestone. Unremarkable otherwise, it is there. Colin, the oldest rabbit in the world. Oh, I named him, that's so sweet. Well, all right, these are my, ex these are my uh, exploits, apparently. I didn't find a bone though, that's odd. I must have missed one. The original door of the bee mart, which used to be on this site. Oh. Apparently I'm the doctor at this point, that's my level of time travel. Then again, he does laugh in the face of archaeologists, so perhaps not quite that level. The winning Hyper Lotto ticket that funded this museum. Interesting. There's a lot of room for different things out here. I must have, just, I must have really uh, gone past a lot of different things at this rate. That was my name or the title of the game, technically. What about this? What about this? Ah, there we go. I might just write down these numbers. Oh, it's the lottery ticket, I see. What about this mysterious door here? Oh, that is the door. Oh. Back to here now. Or the here now. Hello, sir. That was quick. So what did you reckon? Can we get underway? Oh. Oh, I see. So you check... Oh, so you go back in time to check if everything's all right with this area. A temporal recursion vortex, you say? Sounds bad. Indeed. We can't build a museum, we're building a foam superstore. Really? What's that? Ah, uh, hang on. You have the numbers for next week's Hyper Lotto? He says quaking? Yes. Well, I guess we work for you now. Oh, you wanna put a paradox in front of me here, game? Well, I can take that for sure, for sure, for sure. I'll just look up some museum plans on my phone. Oh yeah, it's just he's like building Lego, making a museum. You don't need foundations and shit like that, and like ten years worth of planning and whatnot. Nah, nah. Oh, the dang screen is cracked. I think it says, ah, uh, the end. But you're welcome to carry on. I see that. So technically, if I go over somewhere or other, hang on. Well, I can't get out now. There's a bloody great fence around me. Unless I go back in here. Ah, okay then. So I can just go back around in circles and discover all those things that I missed out on. Because if I go in here, there's a skull and then I can get back here again. Ah, okie dokie then. So apparently there's a bone somewhere around here that I didn't get. But I'm not going to look for it for now. We are going to end this game here. Well then. That was super good. Like I was really confused about it in the beginning. Because I was like, I can't control the thing. How do I do here? So that was a bit of a like, ugh, but then after pressing all the buttons as the usual way of finding out how things work, everything was super cool. So to the developer, well done on this game. It's really neat. I really, really enjoyed it. A nice little bit of theater and nonsense to go with it. So yay, good job on that front. Anyway, we will end that episode here. I will not re repeat the game's title for I don't want to glance at my notebook and cheat. So never mind. You know what the game's called. I know what the game is somewhat called. So there we go. We can just leave it at that and end this episode here. Thank you all so very kindly for watching. Subscribe if you want to see more and I hope to see you in the next one. See you later.